It is important that we keep our hearts clean. Because if we allow wickedness into our hearts, then we will do wrong and we will bear the consequences because the wages of sin is death. Jesus Christ warned us to keep our hearts clean. I read from Mark chapter 7 verse 21 the words of Jesus. For from within, out of the heart of men, proceed the evil thoughts, and fornications, thefts, murders, adulteries, deeds of a coveting and wickedness, as well as deceit, sensuality, envy, slander, pride, and foolishness. All of these evil things proceed from within and defile a man. If we allow wickedness into our hearts, then we will do wrong, we will sin. As also happened to King David, the man of God. He saw a woman that was bathing and lust entered his heart and covetousness. And that caused him to become a murderer. But when God sent the prophet Nathan to him, he repented. And he cried out to God. He said, Create in me a clean heart. I read from Psalm 51, verse 10. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from thy presence, and do not take thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of thy salvation, and sustain me with a willing spirit. David pleaded with God to give him a clean heart. What we need is a clean heart. If we have iniquity in our hearts, then we are not acceptable to God. And then we will do those things that are wicked, and are not pleasing to Him, and we will be removed from His presence. We need to guard our hearts above all things, and ask God to give us a new heart, to clean us out, to forgive all our sins, to make us new inside. And then we need to open our hearts to Jesus, and let Him fill us, fill our mind, fill our being, Stay focused on Him, so that we will bear good fruit and do that which is pleasing to Him. Clean out your heart and keep it clean. Reserve it for Jesus Christ. May Jesus bless you.